Hi, I'm Jordan. Welcome to my channel. I'm so glad that you're here. I'm a stay-at-home mom of two kiddos, a five-year-old and a one-year-old, and we are a homeschool family. Every Monday, I release a day in the life video, and every Thursday, I release an additional video, usually about homeschool or the holidays. Today's video is going to be about what's going to be in my kids' Easter baskets. But before I get into it, please take a moment to like and subscribe. I'm going to go ahead and show you everything that we got our kiddos to put into their baskets. Everything that you see here came either from Five Below or Walmart. So starting with candy, we don't think any Easter basket is complete without a um, chocolate bunny. This year we decided to go with the Hershey Milk Chocolate Bunnies six pack, so each of them will get three. Um, we did the Santa ones for uh, St. Nicholas Day to put in their shoes and they absolutely loved them. And so we decided this would be what we go with this year. Next, we went with these Peeps um, hard candies that are marshmallow flavored. Each of them have one for their baskets. They are like a, like a sweet tart kind of um, consistency. And then another tall kind of candy thing for each of them. Um, my son, we got him Hershey Kisses since he is more likely to want um, the bigger piece of milk chocolate and it has a little bunny on the top, whereas my daughter um, really loves M&Ms. And so we got for the M&M ones with the, the bunny ears. Um, another consistency that we like is Pez. Um, we do them more and more often. Um, my kids really love them. Um, so my son, we got him a little ducky and my daughter a bunny rabbit. Um, then we got each of them a little carton of, Robert, of Robin eggs, which are like the Whoppers that are designed to look like little eggs. And then finally we got them each the Reese's Pieces carrot, or it's like, you know, where it's made to look like that. Next, going through the stuff that's just in my son's basket, um, one thing that we have that is consistent is that we usually put a stuffed animal into the basket. Um, and my son saw this like lazy egg thing. Um, at Five Below when I took him Christmas shopping and he was obsessed with it. He asked for it all the time and um, I had intended to go back at Christmas time and get it for him but when I went they only had the Christmas version with like a Santa hat and not the one that he had actually wanted. So he's now back there so this is his stuffed animal. And then we got actually a lot, we got quite a few things at the Five Below. So they had this Play-Doh tool kit to do like the swirls but also you could um, on the side use that as like a mold. So we got this Play-Doh kit for $5 along with this Play-Doh. And I think what I'm gonna do is since there's 10 pieces here, I'm gonna put five in his basket and five in hers. Also from Five Below, he is really into cats and dogs. And this is just like a bin of cat and dog and cat and dog accessories. Then we got him this marble run. And um, we've been thinking about getting a marble run for quite some time, um, but we saw this at the Five Below and thought that this would be a good opportunity. Also from Five Below, we got the Jigsaw and Book Explore the Ocean. We have gotten the human body one of these, actually I think last Easter, and it was awesome. It was exactly what we needed. And next year we are planning to do an ocean unit study. And so this is gonna be perfect to kind of like double dip for both homeschool and the holiday. And then we always try to get books as well. So along those same lines, we saw this Where's Waldo at Sea activity book. So it's C, he loves Waldo and it has stickers. So it was like all the above everything we wanted. And then we also got these two books. So this one is a book having to do with sharks, which is gonna go well with our ocean study. And also this I Am Brave, a positive power story seemed nice and it was about surfing. So it kind of also went with the ocean. So yeah, so it had everything that we wanted in that regard. For my daughter's basket, her stuffed animal, we found this soft little chicken leg with the smiley face, which, you know, kind of fit, I feel like with the theme of the stuffed animal that we got for our son. And this was at the five below. I mentioned we were going to give her half of the Play-Doh and then one of the Play-Doh kits is for her as well. And then one of the things that she has become absolutely obsessed with is stickers. I feel like that's kind of a common thing with both my kiddos, but we found this pack of just like a ton of stickers along with this book of stickers. And then our idea was to get her just like a notebook to put the stickers on. And I'm aware that my child is not even two yet, 
but just she gets so much joy from just taking stickers and putting them on paper that we thought that this was a really great idea. And all of this came from the five below. We also found this preschool ocean animal activity book um, at the five below. So it, I know that this one is probably way too advanced for her, but um, for the price that it was at and it being on the same theme, I figured that even though this might be too advanced for her now, maybe by the end of the year next year, some of the activities would fit with her and we will still probably be doing this particular unit study. So I thought this would be a good thing to include. Um, but we also always include books like I mentioned. So for her, we got The Moon's Time to Shine um, from the Storybots. We love the Storybots and I think she will find this really interesting as well as an I Spy Elmo book because um, she has an Elmo ABC toy that she really loves. And so I think she'll see this and be able to recognize the characters and get really excited. Um, the final thing that we got for her basket actually came from Walmart. Um, it is like the stack and nest animals. So they stack in each other, but also they're like nesting dolls and they're animals, which are really cute. Um, but we found that the five and below didn't actually have as many things for really little kiddos um, as we were hoping um, to be able to take advantage of, but we think that this one thing actually is going to be a hit. So that should be plenty. So final product, these are my kiddos Easter basket. I'm super excited. I think they're gonna love it. Um, as I said, most of everything I got for them was from five below and the candy along with um, the stacking animals came from Walmart. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. And if you want to see more videos from me, subscribe. Have a great day. Bye-bye.